You know why I wear the bandana? I sweat a lot, like constantly. It's 100 degrees in Florida, so I'm always dripping. So no matter what I do, I got a bandana. I wear the black bandana for the videos. I mean, I could sweat right now. I'm not exerting too much energy. I got the air on, so it's not that bad. I go outside, I got the red, the gray, sometimes the yellow white bandana. I wear it in the blistering sun, so sometimes I got the bandana tan on the forehead. People look at you when you got a bandana on. Were you, you, you in a gang? No, I just, I sweat, right? I mean, people could wear their goofy hats or their, their shirts with words on it. And I always wear a black shirt, by the way. Black shirt, gray shirt, red shirt, nothing on it because, first of all, I, I, I just don't want to advertise anything. Number two, I like the plainness. Let's not distract over here. What are you looking at? Huh? Something that says Fender or Genius or uh, USA or whatever it is. I don't wear anything on the shirt. Plain shirt, bandana, uh, short sleeve, mostly in Florida, right? In Florida. I, I like to wear jeans, but it's too hot. But let's get back to the bandana. The bandana is for the purposes really of, I, I grew up with the bandana, so I'm not getting rid of it. If I go to the gym, yes, I do look like retro 80s guy at the gym. I do, it look, or older retro 80s guy. You know, they spot you from a distance, but I don't wear the socks that are way up, you know, below the kneecap. I don't do that. I don't wear the long shorts. I got this, just a similar look that I've always had. All right, the good thing about the black t-shirt, it's like a Porsche. It has aged well over time. It's the same look. We don't need no fancy every year update the shirt. No, it's good. It's a black shirt. The bandana works. It catches sweat. It helps, you know, when you're, when you're hot so it doesn't drip. It's functional. It's functional and I think the bandana looks good, huh? Come on. And don't forget to subscribe to my new podcast, The Carmen Suricillo Show. You're going to like it. The first episode was like an hour 50, so carve out some time. I know you got a full day. You got work and children and, and spouses, but carve out at least an hour and 50 minutes of your day to listen to me. Put it on while you're sleeping, although it's going to be tough to sleep listening to this. Trust me, because I talk about everything. I'm going to get into it. My podcast is a little more in depth than my videos because the videos, people's attention span is this big, right? With the podcast, you can listen and cut the lawn. You could listen and chop some wood, huh? You're chopping wood for the winter coming, huh? You're getting ready, you're cutting the pine and getting it ready to, to put in a fireplace. I don't know what you're doing, but I'm saying whatever you are doing, you could listen to the podcast at the same time. On the beach, the podcast works. Uh, you know, and the, in the bathroom, the podcast works. The podcast works everywhere. You just can't see me. That's why I'm making videos so you can see the face still. I don't want you to forget the face. Maybe we will f we'll film the podcast, huh? We're gonna film it. And I'll put Frankie yeah, on, I swear to God, I'm gonna put Frankie on the podcast. And maybe some other people. I'm, I didn't want to say anything about Frankie, but Frankie doesn't talk fast. You know what I mean? Frankie's probably gonna, I'm gonna have to force some stuff out of Frank, but you'll enjoy it, you know. Okay. Please. Just give it a shot. Just listen to a little bit of it. Or download it and don't listen to it to give me credit. Maybe a rating. Could you rate it? Five stars? I'm not pushing anybody. This is, this is what you're supposed to do if you like somebody. I'm hoping that people who are watching me like me. Even when I do yell. I, look, I can't change. I can't help that I yell every so often, that I'm emotional, that I am imploring. I am imploring. I can't help it. This is who I am, and I'm, this is who I'm showing you on, on the video right now. So please, I implore you to download that podcast. Just take a listen to it. If you don't like it, delete it. It's so simple. There's no charge. Just delete, fucking delete it if you don't like it. That's all. I mean, you have to return nothing or put it back in its box and send it to Amazon. It's a delete button, I think. Pretty sure. That's how the podcast machine world works. Come on, I'm a little, I'm a little more savvy. I know it's not a podcast machine. 
But see, I can talk, and you know I can talk, so I'm going to be talking about a lot of stuff, including maybe I'll talk about the bandana some more huh? on the podcast. I don't know. You can't see me on the podcast. Please? No, really, I think... Look, there's a lot of podcasts out there, and I have scoured through them, and I'm not saying that mine's better than everybody else's. I'm a little biased, but I was listening to some. I'm like, wow, this is the like the most favorite, or the, how could it be? How could this podcast be so popular? It's a challenge. I get it, but I bring it. I'm bringing it. I'm bringing it. I'm bringing it. <laughs> I wish we could hang together. That's all I'm saying. I wish you could see me live instead of me looking. I'm looking at a circle on a camera, so I can't, you know. And I'm pretending that basically I get to talk to you personally. I wish we could hang out personally because it'd be more fun, a little more relaxed. I wouldn't have to talk as quick, right? We could go, let's go have a drink. You think I don't want to drink? Of course I want to drink. I drank a couple nights ago. I better go. I better go. Just what? Please, I implore you, check out the podcast.